All right, all right, ladies, gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, welcome back to the Outer Worlds. How you doing? I hope you're doing okay. Look at us just aiming that rifle down sight for no reason. Let's uh, let's interact with the uh, deserters, shall we? Move along, stranger. Who we said don't that? want any trouble. I'm not here to cause trouble. I'm just here to talk. I don't know you. Whatever you're looking for, it ain't here. Move along. I'm actually looking for you guys, I think. Answers, huh? You must be one of those philosophicals. Already got ourselves one of those. <sighs> looking for the geothermal plant. Know what that about that. Uh, Reed said something about former workers living in the wilderness. A geo what? Look. Plants ain't my purview. You're better off asking after Adelaide. If you're gonna start wandering around my camp, know that I got my sights on you. That's fine. Now where can I find her? Over in the hothouse, tending crop. Enough with the questions. No offense, but I've got a lot on my mind. That's cool. Uh, we've all got problems. I just got shot into space. Uh, you and me both trying to figure out how to repair my ship. Troubled marauders. You don't know what enough with the questions means? No, I'm sorry. That was unworthy of me. Lady named Zoe went missing some nights ago. Just up and vanished without a trace. Now I'm pacing around wondering if marauders got to her. Mm-hmm. I'll keep an eye out. You can always go looking for her. Don't tell me you're scared of a few marauders. It's not like Zoe to go wandering. Figured she might be out scavenging, but that ain't exactly her talent. Can't imagine where she's gone. Vale's a wide place. She could be anywhere. Uh, unless Marauder's got her parts, <laughs> then parts of her could be in a lot of places. Holy shit! Could do without the gallows humor. I uh, got questions about I'll her. I'll tell you what I can. Yeah, what does she look like, for one? An idea where she might be hiding? Maybe the marauder stick her way? How well do you know her? Well, enough to know we never got on. Zoe and Stefan were close. If anybody knows the workings of her mind, he does. Okay, he seems so personable. Can't imagine you wouldn't get along with her. Yeah, <laughs> shit, just go right in. She was lazy and thoughtless, but she's still one of our own. Uh, any idea where she might be? Vex me. If she told anybody, they ain't telling me. I'd check her room, but I got yelled at for snooping once already. By Stefan? Little ways ago. She was always obsessing over her serial dramas. Wanted to see what the fuss was about. So she was one of those wonder children. Alright. What is it? Goodbye. I'll ask around about her. Oh, shit. Knock! Who are you? If you're hungry, Stefan's got supplies. Where's Stefan at? G you got anything worth stealing? <laughs> and he just walked away, too. You, Stefan? Yes, you are. You hungry? We got canid ribs, canid flank, canid snout, too. Something I can help you with? Uh, not canid anything. You mean Zoe? Yeah, we were pretty close. Not like her to go loping off. Uh, what happened to her? What happened on the day she disappeared? Tell me a little about her. Was she acting strange? Can't say I recall Zoe ever acting strange. Well, except for her habit of writing things down on scraps of paper. She called it journaling, but I think it's just plain odd. You sound like some type of corporate fixer asking all these questions. No, just trying to help find her. Hold on, was there, there was something else? Zoe was always obsessed with this serial. Masked Marketeer. A scion of Byzantium turns to banditry and teaches his marauder companions the wisdom of free market economics. Oh, Shame God. she up and vanished when she did. I had a surprise lined up for her. Uh, what, 
was so about surprising. The other day I got my hands on a genuine copy of the latest Masked Marketeer. I was going to surprise Zoe with it, but she was gone the next day. Right. Zoe and I were going to watch the serials, as is our custom. She never turned up. I looked around, but she was nowhere to be found. Can I look in her room? Hey, I got time. Yeah, you're just kind of sitting here. Nothing, okay. Fresh off the limb, and that includes canid meat. You All you've ever talked about is canid meat, dude. Uh, worker outfit. Worker outfit. Range weapon mod, what does this do? Magazine increases the amount of ammo. Like that. Might have to come back for that. Alright, um... Is this where you and her sleep, or? Nope, this is a shop. Let's look around. Mess hall. Oh, that's Thomas. He used to follow me around before he left the cannery. Okay. You got a stalker there, Pravati? Please walk in the door so I can close it. Walk in the door. Don't scratch your head, you fool. In! Thank you. a really sparse house. This him? Oh, I uh, didn't see you there. I was, uh, well, I was just occupying myself with a little engineering. You were staring at a work Whoa, bench. Miss Parvati. Hey, you're, uh, what, um, how, how are you? Hi, hi, hi. Uh, hello. Are you, uh, uh, are things safe out here? How are you keeping? Great, just great. I've been trying to keep stuff running, just like you. Only I'm not so... Wait, they didn't kick you out, did they? Oh, gosh, no. I I'm just along with this lady here. Are you from town? I, I mean, you don't exactly look like you're from town. Nope, trying to repair my ship. Passing through... I'll take that as a compliment. Well, what I meant was you're reasonably well armed and don't look stricken with plague. Sorry, I just wasn't sure if you were from town or if you were one of us. Something's been chewing at me, you see. Which is? The fact is, I've been, well, lying to everybody here. Camp thinks I'm a mechanical genius, but I couldn't fix a busted chair. Right, uh, never too late to learn. I'll take all the help I can get. I set my mind to learning the craft of the engineer, you see. I want to make something of myself. You ever heard of the Young Spacer's Guide to Mechanical Engineering? Not at it comes all. in a set of three. If I had my hands on one of those data pads, I could teach myself the ins and outs. Those are good. My dad kept a copy with him when he was working in the cannery. I know the old community center kept a copy. Should find another one back in town. If you could find me even one of those pads, I'd be greatly obliged. Sure. Uh, today's your lucky day, Thomas. I've got one of those data pads you wanted. Wait, where did I? I don't. I haven't been to the community center. No kidding. Really? Well, which one? Part two. Found it in the cannery. Oh, I must have looted it. Ain't that just ironical? If I'd worked a little longer back at the cannery, I might have found this myself. I appreciate you going through all that trouble. In fact, I put aside something special. On the off chance that somebody'd search out those data pads for me. <coughs> Let you know if I find the others. Sure. I'd be glad to take them off your hands. Now where's Zoe's house? What's on your mind? Yeah, I don't have that option. Uh... Can't go in there, can't go in there. All right. You Adelaide? If you're hungry, there's meat turning on the spit outside. 
If you're bearing illness, find a place to lay your head down and I'll fetch you a poultice. Whatever your troubles with Edgewater, leave them at the gates and be welcomed here. Any questions, dear? I must be Adelaide. And just who are you? Not here to join the camp. I have been called that, among other things. Green Thumb, Grandmother, the strange old lady who keeps flowers. But yes, Adelaide will do just fine. Excuse me, Miss McDevitt? Sorry, it's just... You got such pretty trees in here. Why, thank you. You're Robert's girl, aren't you? I remember when you were but a sprout. Thomas speaks of you often. Are you staying long? You should try some of my tobacorn tea. I brew it in an old spittoon, but it's been cleaned. That sounds disgusting, especially because it sounds like it's partly tobacco. Uh, Reed sent me to make peace with you. Is this a greenhouse? Looks like you made a home for yourself out here. No, dear. The garden belongs to us all. Life is the gift of the universe, and the universe yields its bounty equally, absent of prejudice. I'm surprised you managed to grow anything out here. Funny you never grow tripe in a garden. The soil around the Vale went sour years ago, but I found a way to sweeten it back up. The secret recipe is a little bit of elbow grease, a dash of love, and a heaping pile of special fertilizer. So you just shit in dirt. Okay. A home for anyone who's ever turned their backs on Edgewater. A home for those of us with nowhere left to go and nothing to lose. Mm -hmm. So like the spores of the puffball, cast on the wind and alighting on fresh soil. We put down new roots. Uh, you picked a terrible place to put down roots. It looks like an actual nice place, but... It is an unpleasant story, dear. But the short of it is that sometimes one wakes up and realizes the place that was once her home for much of her life has changed. The home in which we spent our lives has left us behind, and so we must move on. And that is as much as I will say on the subject. Okay. Reed Thompson, you here on behalf of that cold-eyed reptile? Let's hear it. What's Reed's idea of peace, then? Oh, you're living off power that belongs to the town. Come to the cannery. That's about it. Reed asks you to consider coming back to town. He's willing to make amends. Something about coming back to uh, or town or losing power. I really wasn't listening. Make amends? Spare me. Only thing Reed knows how to make is a mess. Like everything else that comes out of Edgewater, that peace offering is canned. I and my own are living just fine out here by ourselves. Uh, Reed asked me to divert power over to him. He mentioned geothermal plant. This is serious. I'm about to cut off your power. He would do such a thing. The question is... Why would you agree to his plans? Cannery's got a regulator. You want ship parts, you ought to rip them out of the cannery's guts and leave us be. If you're going down to the plant, you should divert power away from Edgewater and toward our end of the grid. Think about it. You'd be liberating an entire town from a lifetime of service to that odious cannery. Seems the sort of thing a hero would do. What if I... I'll consider it. Uh, what do you got against the town? I'm not looking to get mixed up in your problems. Just want to fix my shit. Definitely. A uh, hero to you, maybe. You've seen that miserable excuse for a town with your own lamps. Hollowed out workers laboring their lives away at the cannery. Living off whatever scrap spacer's choice throws them. You know that's true, don't you, Ms. Holcomb? Your father died of overwork. His heart gave out. He, he was tired all the time, sure, but he was old, ma'am, and he raised me all by his lonesome. Look what they did to this child. Lost her family to the company, and still she defends them. Uh, you made your point clear. I'll see what I can do. 
I don't much like you throwing that in her face to get me on your side. Yeah, definitely. That's pretty fucked. Uh, what do you have against the people trying to make a living? Let's say I help you. What happens to Edgewater? Life in Edgewater grinds to a halt. The cannery shuts down. Workers desert in droves. And our own little camp grows and thrives. You bring power to Reed's town and you'll be killing us. Reed knows it. He's counting on it. Uh, what if I kill Reed? I trust you will listen to your conscience. I can kill him and see what I... See if you guys can go back willingly. <laughs> Thank you, you creepy son of a bitch. Uh, is... Just a little. What's this? So he's journal. Find Zoe. All right, out of town. Let's see what a uh, journal, journal, journal. Let's do first. Let's find her. Seems to be close by. Reload. Oh boy, that's a that's a big boy. Come on, shoot him. Hey, here we go. There, there we go. go. Assault rifle, lovely. Oh shit! Done. Right, where? There she is. some heavier armor that works that works well and we can give her this is nine versus seven what he got heavy ammo good Whose legs did I blow off? This dude's? Oh god, there's mines! I need you to sit. I need you to sit down. Sir, sit down. Uh, 
and a finger from him. I don't know anybody who ever came out this far. Okay. That. And we can put her in some heavier armor too. There we go. We're just walking tanks. Shunt. Boy, am I low. I think we killed all of them, right? Nope, there's one left. Where is she? Oh my god. Zoe. Really, Encore? Wow. You crossed them all off, like some sort of heroic accountant running down a list. Excuse Please me? Your ways. What? You mean Adelaide's little congregation of nature-loving nobodies? I could not possibly be less interested in them. You, on the other hand, you were a sight to behold. If I had half your skills, I'd be the greatest outlaw the coast has ever seen. I need you to just clarify something for me. I'm great at clarifying. Are you a prisoner here? Uh, no. I insinuated myself into their company, see? And they didn't seem to mind one whit. So they just let, okay. Barted them a few boxes of Adrena time, but yeah, I'm sure that's got nothing to do with it. Right, definitely. I don't know. The vital processes that constitute the miracle of life are mysterious and unknowable. Funny. Oh, you mean around these guys? The marauders wouldn't hurt me. They love me. I'm practically their queen. Yeah, it must be my natural charisma. So why'd you leave? I got kicked out of Edgewater on account of falling sick with plague and stealing some medicine to treat myself. I'd heard some outlaws set up camp in the botanical labs. I decided to throw in with them, seeing as I always wanted to be an outlaw myself. Instead, what do I find but a bunch of former workers camped out around a greenhouse. I couldn't just go back to the cannery, so I was stuck with them. Okay, uh, I've got all the time in Halcyon. Yeah, I don't think. Oh, that. Why? Adelaide wants me back on garden duty or something? Thanks, but I'm not going anywhere. This is where I belong. Intimidate? Why would I intimidate her? I doubt that. Nobody in that camp really cared about me. What about Stefan? You two are friends. Wait, you're telling me he's got a copy of the Mass Marketeer? Why didn't you say so? I'll take my stuff and head on back, I suppose. Grace is going to be glaring knives at me, so I've got yeah. that to look forward to. She's who sent me. Bye. All right, let's loot what we can and get the hell out of here. Is this just... No, not really that not too much of use here. Did it? Okay. Well, 
model spaceship. Probably something I can sell. Uh, that person has been evicted. There's nothing in there. In here. This is a little shop. Or formerly a shop. No, it's not. It's definitely not wise to be walking around with a frozen dinner in your fucking backpack. Oh, oh my god, that sounded painful. Go home, Zoe. Okay. I don't know if I need to turn up the sensitivity or turn it down. Feels kind of weird. Right, let's get uh, some experience from Grace. What is it? Should be on our way back. We didn't always get along, but I'm glad to know she's safe. What happened, anyway? Zoe joined up with a band of marauders. Zoe. The same Zoe who doesn't know a barrel from a trigger. Well, I've heard stranger things. You pretty much did my job for me. Least I could do is pay you for your trouble. Thank you. Let me know if I can do something for you. Goodbye. Companion perks. Uh, your companion is leveled up and can be granted new perks. Lovely. All right, first of all... Yeah, we're uh, a little, little behind on stealth. Where goes into okay medical stuff is tech. Okay, I do probably need to repair some stuff. So, do I have any more perk points? No. Uh, wait. There she is. She's all the way at the back. What is this? Bolter pistol. You know what? Let's actually put that on me. Equipped it. Yeah, I guess we can do that instead of the, uh... How do I do her? There we go. Perks. Yeah, let's give her more health for sure. Ooh. Lovely. Right. Journal. So I suppose we really... Companion quest. Oh, he's a companion. Okay. Check that out. We'll probably just head back, head to the geothermal plant before, uh, or at, before we leave. Primal nest. Oh my. Oh no. Nope, we're not, not doing that. We're gonna go around that. Need grenades. 
Grenades is what I need. Excuse me, sir, can you fucking not? Thank you. I am very much appreciate that. Alright, um There was another one around here. That's the last of them. Oh, this must be the community center. I need to find a merchant and trade all this stuff in. Is that Edgewater or is that... Oh my god. Yeah, just taking that from the side. Gotta love laser weapons. Provi Why didn't you just rush away from me, girl? You shouldn't be doing that. Now he's dead. Oh my god. We did it. Yes, yes we did. You did a good job. Spread hide. Whatever the hell a spread is. To be honest, that's probably just short for Space Rat, and that's kind of dumb. Parts should be good for crafting pretty soon. All right, so let's actually equip some of the quests that take us in here. water and there's me saying it was like a giant jar of milk nope no, don't want to leave what do we got what do we 
got. Wait, what is this? Picked up. That, right? Didn't I? Yes, I did. Okay. Let's just take all this first aid stuff. What is this? Stun baton. Okay, cool. Can I, like, disassemble things? Oh, uh, what is that? Just a saw? Is this the front area where I mer- Yes. Oof. Okay. Nope. Out we go! Twice the speed at half the price. What does that mean? Is it just speed in an injector or a syringe? Oh, that's back to town. Huh, interesting. Okay, so. Turn it, there's one last finger we have to collect. Where is that at? Over this way? And th that's also back towards the power plant, right? Can't open that. Yep, that's the geothermal plant. How do we get up? Does it? No, it doesn't follow the river. Like it's just around it? Wait a minute, I thought we've been back here. Did I just not find his finger? Are they in a cave somewhere? Or maybe I just went the wrong way. I think I did. Why not just loot this one? Why not? Because there's nothing in here to loot. I 
I'm over encumbered, aren't I? Yep, yes I am. I, when did I pick up an axe? Hold on. <laughs> uh, break down. Two hundred and ten, two fifteen versus one eighty. Oh, jeez. No, God damn it. Unequip why can't I and then That's better. All right, now into the geothermal plant. If we can make it through, that is. Ow. The real question is how do we get in here? Gorgeous. Yeah, I've been through here. Oh, searching. Here they come. Let me kill. How do I? Oh, there's a hole in the wall. Oh my god. Alright, so we need a couple of things from in here. Nope. Die robot die. We get one specifically from a lit a operational robot, not living. Okay. The control room should be off to the right. I hope we're doing the right thing. Well, I haven't made a decision yet, but... I meant grab the Was that a shotgun? It was. All right. Uh So I have to kind of cycle through. Wait. Where did Why did it replace the sh God damn it. All right, hold on. And then we're gonna... Options, swap it. 
with this. Right, climb down, excuse me, buddy. She said off to the right. Incoming! From where? Oh my god. Alright, what is this? Okay. Here. Can't get through there. Oh, I think this might be it. Uh, redirect power plant status. It, it, please activate all three, okay, electrical swatches. Three switches, that'll be easy enough. Yeah, here's hoping. Down we go. A locked door. Lotion, whatever the hell that means. System. Here they come. Really? This is not doing that much against it, is it? There we go. Bracelet, just a random bracelet, lovely. Anything in here? Besides a corpse. But I'm over encumbered again. Alright, let's uh, break that down. I need to stop picking up uh, shit. Oh, it just adds it to junk. To Miss McDevitt. Coming! Find something else! Down they go! Uh, oh! Hello! There we go. Oh. Get away! Wow. Right, where you at, Higgins? Not there. Maybe down this way? No! 
no, no, just leave me alone. I can't leave you alone if I don't know where you are. Mind the steam. You're liable to get scalded. Nothing here. Oh. Expecting. Here they come. Oh, Jesus. I need grenades. Pravati's down. Pravati is down because we got outflanked. Oh, flaw tutorial during your. Okay. I can. Uh, character can trigger a flaw. Offer. Take a flaw is optional, but doing so will provide you with a perk. Uh, auto mechanicals now give you the willies. Minus one to dexterity. No. Uh, reject. Two. If we send the power to Miss McDevitt, what happens to the veil? I have no clue. But. I think we will find out, oh my god, in a moment. So I thank you so much for watching, ladies and gentlemen, citizens of the Empire. And when we return, we're going to probably finish up Edgewater and whatnot. So I will be back in a moment.